Another winter has come and gone at Mount Buller and as always we just couldn't get enough of our time in the snow. As we head into the warmer months it's great to look back at all the fun we've had on top of the world and everything we have to look forward to for next winter. This season we enjoyed 107 days of skiing and boarding with peak snow depths of 115 centimetres in man-made areas and up to 83 centimetres of natural coverage. On the 23rd of August we scored a dumping of 22 centimetres and enjoyed boot deep turns across the mountain. Three different terrain parks were built across the season and they played host to three Frank Health Insurance Expression Sessions. These were a great opportunity for beginners to advance riders to get involved, win some prizes and show off their moves. The season was filled with events ranging from the opening weekend celebrations to three film festivals and the National Yuki Gassen Championships. The big competitions of the year included the infamous Cattleman's Rail Jam, which was won by Jai Kearney. Mount Buller played host to the Subaru Victorian Interschools, the South Australian Interschools and the Australian National Interschools this year. There were exciting developments and some incredible racing. One of the last and certainly one of the biggest events of the season was the 25th annual James Bogues A-Bomb Mogul Challenge. The best riders in the country battled it out on Chamois and this year Brodie Summers and Nicole Parks took out the titles. To wrap up the season, skiers and boarders dressed up in all their trashiest gear from the 80s and had one last big party in the snow. On behalf of everyone here at Mount Buller, I'd like to invite you all back on top of the world for some more fun and adventures in the snow. I'll see you when you're shredding. This is Chris Mocroft on top of the world at Mount Buller.